Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Black Eyed Ricky, and today I am actually playing. I don't know the name, but it's by JMF Productions. So if you simply look up JMF PRD, you should be able to find it. Anyways, Anyways this game is actually really fun, I've heard. This is made in 2011. Dang. But you guys are probably thinking, bro, why do you have another. Another anime thing. Bruh. This isn't an anime channel. Well, you're right. But I want to. So, from the looks of it, the girl on the left... The girl on the left has big boobs. Are we... Are we gonna... Have a relationship with her? Um... And the girl on the right has smaller boobs. Just an observation. Let's start this game. This video probably won't be that long. Probably about 15 minutes. But it's a very long game. Let me just... Summer of the ninth year of High Sai Era 1997. Life has its way of changing. Often drastically without any warnings whatsoever. True. At first, a day may seem like any other, but by tomorrow it can all change, not just from where you live, but who you are as a person. Just recently, I experienced such a large change. My dad wanted to start his own grocery shop, so my parents and I moved to a small village near Osaka. I had a hard time readjusting. The move from Tokyo to a small village, small lost village, Far from a big city with shops and fast food restaurants. It's hard for a 19-year-old student such as myself. I was used to the excitement of the big city. However, my life would s soon change on my first day of school. Ring. I switched off the alarm clock and went back to sleep. That's me. That is honestly me. Actually, I still don't know why I'm up this late. If you look at the clock, it's 9.46. I'm so tired. Having nothing to do outside, I stayed up late on my computer. Yeah, that seems fair. I don't even remember when I fell asleep. Taiji, wake up! You'll be late for school! Huh? What time is it? 8.02? Wait, is he, is he not late for school yet? And I start school at 8.30. Lucky duck. Lucky duck. I have to get up at 5 o'clock in the morning just to go to school. and Or just to go on the bus. And then go to a, a school to take another bus to my school. Which takes like 2 hours. And oh, My school starts at 7.35. It's pretty ridiculous. Damn it, I'm late. So I'm guessing I'm Tai Chi. Uh, is that, is that some anime over there? On the right? I jumped out of bed. I put on my brand new school uniform and ran down the stairs. Nice house. This is beautiful art. I ate my breakfast faster than usual. Yeah. I took a map with a route to school and left after saying goodbye to my parents. Good job. I followed the map and dashed through the streets. You better. This town looks unique. Mm. It is a strange town, a mix between a suburb and a rural vi rural village. Huh. Imagine that being a mixture. That's actually quite interesting to think about. Summer has arrived. The Kikadas were crying like they often do in Japan. And it is not hot. And is it, it is hot out here. It, is this not Japan? Whatever. I noticed only a few people on the streets. Some of them were kind enough to help me find my way to school. Then suddenly, as I was near an intersection, I saw a girl in, in a school uniform. He was looking at the butt. Since the village only has one school, that must be where she's heading. And if that is where she is going, most likely, maybe she could help me. I approached her carefully as I didn't want to scare her. She looks beautiful. Long black hair, a thin body, and beautiful legs. 
So he wasn't looking at the bum, he was looking at the legs. I, hesita I hesitated for a moment before saying anything. Ahem. <clears throat> Excuse me, miss. Oh god, look at that art. Look look at that arc art. When is a hand supposed to go through a tie? When do two hands connect? What is this? There was good art. There's good background art, but what about the actual art? She turned around to face me. Um, I would be extremely concerned about her health. Oh god, she was insanely pretty. Yeah, I could see that. Her eyes are strange for a Japanese woman, though. They're blue, so it is Japan. I knew it! Or did I? I don't know. But a wonderful deep ocean blue. And I mean very clean. A very clean ocean. Like those in Hawaii. Kawaii! Cringe. She looks at me, confused and timid. Yes? Wow, her voice sounds so cute. She's so cute that I was at a loss for words. Uh, I'm new in the village, and I'm trying to find my school. And since you're wearing a uniform, I th thought you could... The girl stares at me with her big, wonderful blue eyes. But finally she smiled. Okay, that's somewhat better. Somewhat. Of course I can. I'm going there right now. You can follow me. That'd be great. Thank you. So we walked to school together. Damn, looks like it's my lucky day. My first day of school, and I'm going there with a beautiful girl. You said you're new in town, right? Hmm? I had been daydreaming, so I didn't notice that she was talking to me. She started to blush. Interesting blush there. And what's with her hand? It's going straight through her hair. Oh, that artwork, that artwork is gonna make me mad. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to surprise you. She's so cute. I smiled to myself. You're not. Actually, I just arrived last Friday. My family just moved here from Tokyo. There's gotta be something missing there. You're from Tokyo? It's such a wonderful city. I wish I could visit it someday. I bet. Since we got here, I found I haven't found any distractions like in Tokyo. Hmm. It's true. The village is kind of quiet, so there's usually nothing to do. That artwork. That artwork is gonna kill me. When we want to enjoy ourselves, we usually go to the nearest city. But we have a train to take us there, so it's okay. Look at that background art, though. That background art looks so beautiful. I feel like it was taken by a picture and then repainted. And it's amazing. But then the art here, it's gonna mess with my brain. Because they tried to do it on a laptop or a computer or something. And they failed! A train? To get to the closest city. I hope there's a lot of stuff there. There is. Don't worry. There's fast food restaurants, shops, arcades. You like arcade games? Very much so. I'm especially a fan of music and rhythm games. Geometry Dash, Love Live, things like that. But I, I really enjoy shooting games too. Keeper. She's a keeper. She's a keeper. Keeper. Keep the damn girl. Shooting games. Wow, I can't imagine such a cute and timid girl shooting zombies or soldiers in an arcade. Anyway, what grade are you in? I'm in second section. Second section? You see, in it's the only school in the village. And the students are of different ages. And there's an unbalanced amount of students for the usual grade system. So they made different classes called sections of 25 students each. That sounds fun. I wonder where I'll, where I will be assigned to. Well, there are five sections. So I have one in five chance of being in the same section as you. Oh my god. Chances. Chances. But there's also a four in five chance that he's not going to be in the same section. I'm just going to call Taiji me. I chuckled a bit and she giggled, a little embarrassed. My name is Akira. Like, like Shakira? Sakira? And yours? Name's Tai Chi. Tai Chi. Nice to meet you, Tai Chi-san. Pleased to meet you. 
as well, Sakura san. She showed me a sweet smile. God, if a smile could kill, I think I'd be dead right now. Oh god. Deep down, I really hope to be in the same class as her. Well, yeah. You obviously love her. Ship! Ship! I'm calling it now. It's a ship. I want to see her again and learn more about her. Do I ever get to see my character? I can't believe it. I've been assigned to the second section. That's awesome. I'm so happy. However, I wonder if it is a good section. True. I wonder if it... I wonder... I wouldn't like to be in a classroom full of jerks or something. If that's the case, I just hope I'll be near secure son. Bump. While I was daydreaming again, I bumped into someone. Oh god, who was it? It's a cute girl with light blue hair. Oh, you messed up. You messed up, man. Oh my god, those eyes. And that artwork again. Beautiful background, but they tried to make it with a computer, the characters, and they messed up. They done goofed. And the eyes. The eyes. Hey, you. Watch where you're going. I'm sorry. It was my fault. Well, it was your fault. Wait, you're new here, aren't you? Look at that hair, though. That's pretty cool. I wish I had hair like that. And the eyes go back. What the heck? They were normal for a second. I'll see you later. Dot, dot, dot. What the heck was that run? She ran down the hall, probably heading to her classroom. Yeah. That girl was rude, but rather cute looking. Oh my god. She reminds me of the main girl of the anime Domo Kochan. Because of her hair. And from where I could see, her personality as well. Nice. Nice. Real nice. Here it is. Second section's classroom. Imagine that. A one in five chance. That's like saying you have a... You have a one in five chance of surviving something. And you end up surviving it. It's a miracle. It really is. Some of the students were already here. Secure San was right. There are a lot. A lot. There are. They are all of different ages. The youngest one looked about eight years old, and the oldest about twenty. Dang. The artwork, the desks, and all that looked really good. But the artwork, I'm gonna constantly bring that up. I saw Sakura San sitting by the window. She smiled when she saw me. Ah, Taichi San. Over here, there's a desk available here. She pointed the empty desk behind her. Oh, she get he gets he gets to get it from behind. He gets to go behind. Uh, please don't. Please, please don't make this age restricted. Luckily, a desk near her. Lucky, a desk near her. This is really my lucky day. Did I say that right? This is really my lucky day. I felt like I said this is my lucky gay. I'm sorry if I did. I'm so excited. We are in the same section. I know, right? So am I. So what are we having today? Math. Ugh. Ugh. Math. Youch. Yeah, Taichi gets it. I get myself. Looks like my luck can't last all day. Eh. I don't get it. I or I do get it, but you're with the girl you have a crush on. Deal with math. You're fine. You don't like math? Well, I'm not very good at it. I'm pretty good with math. I can help you if you want. Ooh. That sounds perfect. Thanks a lot, Secure Senpai. Oh my god, he just went to the Senpai. He did not just go to the Senpai. He did not. Not did he. Did. Oh my god. Oh, so much. An essential element of Japanese seniority based status relationships. Similar to the way that family and other relationships are decided based on age. With even twins being divided into elderly and younger sibling, senpai is roughly equivalent to the western concept of a mentor, while kai is roughly equivalent to a protege. 
Oh, okay. So senpai is like teacher. Interesting. D, you're welcome. Class has started without anything noteworthy. To be honest, the math was pretty easy. It was planned for every level, probably because all the different ages in class. The lessons just seemed so long. After lunch, I asked Sakura-san if there were clubs like in normal schools. I, I, well... Oh, I was about to say, well, there only are about, like, what, 125 students? I wouldn't be surprised if there isn't. Yes, I'm in the manga club. Is that the only club? I want to know now. I like it, plus, it was founded by a cosplayer. Ooh. Ooh, cosplayer. A type of performance art in which participants wear costumes and accessories to represent a specific character or idea. Characters are often drawn from popular fiction in Japan, but recent trends have included American cartoons and sci-fi as well as other pop culture. Okay. A manga club? Awesome, I love manga. You do? Oh yeah, that sweet itchy, bro, that sweet itchy. That's great. You're more than welcome if you want to join us, Tai Chi san. That would be awesome. I just hope that this founder will let me join. I'm sure she will. We always need new members, especially right now. She? Yep. You know, a lot of girls enjoy anime and manga. Yeah, I know. Actually, I have an older sister who loved Sha Shu Shuho anime and manga. I'm gonna read this. No! No! I cl oh, fudge. But that was when she was younger. Now she is married and live and living in Tokyo with her husband. I wonder how she's doing. I should email her when I get back home. How many members are in the club? Actually, it's just the two of us. Wait, just Sakura and Taichi? What about the cosplayer? That's all? Yeah. Actually, it's rather hard to find new members, considering the only manga shop around is in the city. Usually, the people that join get too bored to find new manga, so they end up leaving the club. I see. My goodness, joining a manga club with only two girls. Okay, so that's including the cosplayer. Okay. I was thinking maybe she was the cosplayer. <laughs> That'll be nice. My luck is back, or so it seems. So shall we go? Sure, you lead the way, Sakura Senpai. Let's go. I followed her while walking through the halls up to the stairs and into a little classroom. I love this art. I'm loving this art. I'm absolutely loving it. Excellent art here. The room, was, the room has a few desks, all places to make a big table. Probably got that wrong. There were some manga posters on the wall and bookshelves full of mangas and art books. A girl was happily sitting at the table. Oh, nice. She looks pretty cool. Sakura-san, how are you? Rika-chan, good to see you. Okay, looks like Rika-chan is probably going to be a big star th part of this story, but... I found a new member for the club. Huh? Hello there. I instantly recognized the girl, the same one that I had bumped into this morning. Really? The one with the crazy eyes? She, she doesn't look like it. She looks all cute and innocent. Why are their hands in the same position? That's kind of creepy. Oh, her name is Rika. So her name is Rika. You, there's the eyes. I knew it was coming. You. You know him already? Yeah, he bumped into me in the hallway this morning. Hey, I already told you that I'm sorry. I was daydreaming and I didn't see you. Huh, daydreaming about girls, weren't you? Yeah, that's sweet and she, you know. Wait, I just realized. Aren't they anime? And they're in an anime and manga club? They're like anime and anime. This anime likes anime. Animeception. Hashtag animeception. Ugh. Yikes. Well, actually, she kind of... She is kind of right. I felt embarrassed. He likes anime and manga, plus he seems quite motivated. Do you want to give him a chance? Don't worry, Taichi-san. Rika-chan is always like this with boys. I see. I just hope she doesn't kill me in my sleep. Yeah, with those crazy eyes and that weird drawing, I can see why you would hope not, that would not happen. Hmph. <laughs> 
All right, I accept. Welcome to the club, Mr. Techi. Nice to meet you. Yeah, likewise. Now that I've seen her up close, I noticed that her eyes were unlike Sakura's. Well, yeah, hers are like ocean blue. Hers are like blue. Like regular blue. They're blue and green. Oh my god, one of them is blue and green. One of them is blue and one of them is green. Oh my god, I didn't notice that before. That's awesome. The guy who she allows to dive into them will be very lucky. But is there any guy who will get that chance if she doesn't like boys? Oh my god. I'd like to dive into those eyes. If you don't mind me saying, Rika-san, you look like Domoko-chan. Rika-san smiled, and she looked rather cute. Eh. Yes, I like cosplaying her as her. She's my favorite. You've seen the show? I love it. It's a really funny cartoon. Rika-chan. Can you do a really good imitation of Domoko-chan? Watch this. Pee pee roo pee roo pee roo pee roo. I don't get it. I seriously don't. How is it? That's great. Looks just like the real thing. Very true. Glad you liked it. So anyway, Taiki tai Chi San, what's your favorite manga? My all-time favorite one. Hmm. I start to think. There are a few things that I like. There is a lot of etchy. I knew it. I knew it. Let's look at the. Beware, kids. No, I can't. Uh, but it's always good to be honest with girls as well. What should I say? High School Samurai and Echi Shonen Manga. Rosetto Maiden, a sign-in manga, manga about vampire dolls. Let's go with Echi. If you guys don't know what Echi is, I'm not going to say it. Just look it up on your own time. Let's tell the truth. After all, maybe they don't know about this one. I love High School Samurai. It's a great one. Oh, those eyes. Those eyes. They're gonna kill me. Does she even know what High School Samurai is? I know I don't. Rika-san looks pissed again and secure san chan what's the, what's the difference between San and Chan? I should have been paying attention. Turned red. She doesn't even look red. She's still as pale as my last name. My last name is White. Youch! Maybe I made the wrong choice. Maybe you did. Ha, huh, you really are a boy. A real pervert. Yep, that's me. I start ha hanging my head in shame. But suddenly, Sakura-san spoke. Thank you, Sakura-san. Are, are you gonna save me? Actu actually. Rika-chan. High school samurai isn't bad at all. You see, the hero isn't the usual boy of harem mangas. He looks more like a real hero. He has a great sense of honor, and all the monologues he says are are, are very right and heroic. I admire a hero like this. And by the way, the hero isn't really a pervert himself, since every etchy scene where he's involved in happens accidentally. Really? Oh, her eyes went back. I guess it's okay then. The evening comes and we need to go home. Rika-chan took a different way from us, so Sakura-san. Sakura-chan and I returned together to our homes. It was the end of June, so the sun was still up in the sky. So you like high school samurai? I turned my face away from her. Thanks again for saving me. Looks like Rika-san doesn't like that kind of manga. manga. I know I like that kind of manga. It's okay, Rika-chan probably forgot about it already. And to be honest, I enjoy High School Samurai for real. Oh god, I don't know what to think of this. You really do? Yes! It's a great man manga. The hero is really manly. And the girls are very cute too. Ah... Uh... Yes, especially the main one. I wish I can look like her someday. You're actually just as cute, though, Sakura-san. Oh my god, we just said that, didn't we? Stupid Taichi. I said that without thinking. You think? I was on the verge of taking my words back until she replied. You, you think so? 
She turned red with embarrassment. So cute. So cute that I felt embarrassed too. Well, yeah, yes. You really are a pretty girl, Sakura san. Why, thank you, Ta Taichi Kun. Kun? Is she trying to call me that word? How dare she? How dare she? How dare she? She hesitated for a long time before thanking me. Her being timid? Probably. We finally reached the crossroads of our respective houses. Sakura chan, since I don't know the path to school very well, do you mind if we go to the high school together every day? Sure, I'll wait for you here tomorrow. Alright, thank you, Sakura chan. You're welcome. See you tomorrow, Tai Chi Kan. See you. I looked at her walking in the streets. Her little bum was swaying a little at each step with her hair moving with the summer wind. Now he's looking at the bum. Now he's looking at the bum. Of course. Watch her end up being a guy. That would be funny. Kikadas were crying, giving the atmosphere something dreamy and peaceful with the hot summer weather. Dang. It's hot like me. <laughs> da, da, da. I think I'm starting to enjoy my new life at last. Is that the end of, like, episode one or something? Dear sister, how are things? Me and my parents have arrived at our new home. Things are so different from Tokyo, it's peaceful and there's nothing to do in the village. One needs to take the train to find some thing to do in the nearest big town. I just came back from my first day at school. I made two friends there. Things have changed a lot, but I think I'll be used to it soon. I have two friends and my two friends and I are in a manga club at school. Since they're they are girls, are there any shuho mangas that I should speak about that with them? I hope you'll visit us in our new house someday. Your dear brother, Taichi. Nice. So, anyways, guys, I think this is going to be the end of this episode. If you guys want more of this, um, then please do consider hitting that like button. If I can get one like. One like, that's it. I will continue the series. In fact, I'll probably just continue it anyways. But if I get one like, I'll be very glad... And, yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you like to hit the like button down below, please do consider subscribing because it helps me out a lot. And, yeah, I remain not a hater, but I'll see you later, Baker Haters. See ya!